Dear 10 year old Liam, get ready, it's about to get a little bumpy. Cherish every moment with your loved ones right now, as there's only a few more family holidays to enjoy. Life is about to turn surreal. In the wake of Liam Payne's tragic death, tributes have been pouring in. BBC Radio 2 and radio presenter Scott Mills are looking back at an appearance by the singer in 2020 when he wrote a letter to his 10-year-old self. During the pandemic, Liam came on my show and we were asking people to write a letter to their 10-year-old selves. Liam's is so poignant today. Now, I just need to give you a little warning. This is it's quite sad to listen to, but I just really, really wanted to play it to you today. In the sweet message, Payne alludes to the ups and downs in his journey rising to fame at such a young age as part of One Direction, and he encourages his young self to cherish his loved ones. Dear 10-year-old Liam, get ready, it's about to get a little bumpy. Cherish every moment with your loved ones right now, as there's only a few more family holidays to enjoy. Life is about to turn surreal. You know that thing you love, singing? Keep it up. When you turn 14, something magical is going to happen. And I'm not talking about puberty. Not only will you audition for one of the biggest music shows in the world, but you'll also meet the future mother of your child. I know, it seems early, but just trust me, it's all going to work out however it's supposed to. I suggest you watch Back to the Future. It might help. You are now famous, and it feels like you've peaked way too early, you cocky little bugger. But you've barely even started yet. Take it down a notch and remember, it's a marathon, not a sprint. Let me tell you, this isn't even base camp and for a while you'll feel like giving up, but don't as you're about to meet four other guys on the same track as you. When you first meet them, it's going to be chaos, but just remember to enjoy yourself, stay young at heart, as that what, that's what this point in your life is all about. Forgive more and learn to listen. He then reflects on the arrival of his young son, Bear, whom he shares with ex Cheryl. You'll have the most amazing time of your life, travel the world, and live a life you barely imagined. Then it will end for a while, and you will be left with nothing but the steering wheel. It will feel scary, like you're alone, but you are not. You're about to start a total new journey with the most amazing person you've met so far, your son, Bear. Don't doubt yourself at this dad thing. Just look at all the things you've learned along the way. Surely that must mean you have a lot to give. Be grateful and try to remember every day you're doing something you love that took 10 years to build. The first single will skyrocket and you'll never see it come in, but stop with the self-doubt and you'll be fine. Give mum, dad and all the family a big hug from me. His family now grieving put out a statement soon after Liam's death, which read in part, we are heartbroken. Liam will forever live in our hearts and will remember him for his kind, funny and brave soul. We are supporting each other the best we can as a family and ask for privacy and space at this awful time. The former One Direction member passed away on October 16th after falling from a hotel balcony in Buenos Aires. He was 31 years old.